Apologies once more. We'll return to that feed once we have it corrected. Now, Sisala West District Director of Health has expressed worry over inadequate personnel uh, protect, personal protective equipment for personnel of the hospital. Now, Cecilia Kakaraba said the district could only boast of five protective cover cloth, and when they had two suspected cases, they had to limit the usage by reducing the number of people who had to attend to the patients. Now, worst of all, there, there's no single infrared thermometer in the whole district, making it difficult for them. Cecilia Kakaraba made a statement when the Apple West reached Minister Dr. Hafiz bin Sali met with members of the Sisala West Public Health Epidemic Committee at Bolu. From where John Issa's Rafiq Salam reports. Sisala West District Director of Health Services Cecilia Kakarba vividly recalled the programs undertaken by the District Public Health Epidemic Committee in fighting the COVID 19 pandemic and cerebrospinal meningitis CSM. We, together with uh, NADMO, we registered all travel in, people who travel from Accra and Kumasi, those when the, uh, the, 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 uh, the effect was in Kumasi and Accra, now it's everywhere. Those days, that's about two or one month ago, we did registration. And then just Monday and Tuesday, Monday and yesterday, Tuesday, we went around and took sputum sample of 97 of them. We could not trace all of them, some went back. But we were able to take 97 uh, uh, travel in the district uh, sample yesterday. She then opened up on the logistical challenges they are facing. But our key challenges, as I said, have to do with the infrared thermometers. As a district, we don't have a single one. The hospital, were having, they were, uh, hospital was having one thermometer as of now. It's also broken down. So we don't do triaging at the OPD level, which is very risky for us as a district. Very, very risky. We don't have the marks, the face marks, which is now the general declaration that everybody, if in a hospital setting you don't wear a mask, then one can remember, I mean, can imagine what will happen. Then gloves, which is key. Now we have to be in gloves and masks before we touch whatever. And then the protective color roll. When we had, the region gave us uh, five, and we have two suspected cases. And because we even have to minimize it or to manage it, to limit the number of staff that will have to attend to the client because we do not have the PPEs. So we limited. It was doctor and if, um, maybe another one nurse that we assigned to attend to that case because of the lack of PPEs. And so that is not adequate. For now, I think we have just three or how many as a district. Papa was regional minister, Dr. Hafiz bin Saleh Kring, upon hearing of the myriad of challenges and donated his personal non-contact thermometer and 2,000 Ghana cities to the Sisala West Health Director with a promise of adding more. Having said that only a few days ago, I took delivery of some items from a worthy son of the Upper West Region, Al Haj Yusuf Yakub the managing director of Yusuya Ghana Limited. And we distributed the items and your hospital is a beneficiary. So it is, it is no, no longer the case that you don't have infrared thermometer because among the items we allocated one infrared thermometer to the district among many others. The Sisala West District is yet to record a single case of COVID-19, but for CSM, they have recorded eight confirmed cases with one death. Earlier, the Upper West Regional Minister met members of the Sisala West District Security Committee, which was held behind closed doors. Reporting for Joy News, Rafik Salam, Bolu.